guys, welcome to another episode of Elisa's Eats and today I'm going to show you how to make edible jack-o'-lantern dessert bowls. I'm really excited because it's a really cute idea and it's fun for like all ages, especially my age. <laughs> and yeah, it's really simple, really quick, so let's get started. So these are the ingredients you're going to need, there's not many of them so it's pretty easy. To make the bowls, you're going to need about 200 grams of white chocolate. Now, if there's slightly more or slightly less, because let's be honest, we're going to eat some of it, it's okay. One teaspoon of canola oil or vegetable oil. Between 80 to 100 grams of dark chocolate. Now, this is going to put your features on your jack-o'-lantern, so you might need more or less. One quarter teaspoon of canola oil. And then some red and yellow food coloring, or you could use just straight orange. You can use powdered or gel, I'm using gel. Let's get started. So you might be wondering why we have some water balloons and balloons. Not just because we're having a party in here with my good friend Jack. These are going to be the molds for our little bowls. And so I've got a few different sizes. I've got a regular balloon, I've got a water balloon, and then I've got a very tiny water balloon because I really want to make a small one just because I love mini things. That's why I love Flavia. Oh! <laughs> we're going to wash these to make sure that there's no dust or anything because sometimes there's a little bit of dust so they don't stick. Um, and you don't really want to eat that. So we're going to wash these. And that's how you wash a balloon. Amazing! So difficult. Okay, you want to make sure these are completely dry before you use them. My suggestion is just to flick them just because it's really fun. You can also just use a paper towel, but yeah. Okay, but what we're going to do now is we're going to add our vegetable oil to our white chocolate and then melt it in the microwave on 30 second bursts, stirring in between until it's all nice and melted. So now what we're going to do is add our food colouring to our white chocolate and get it to a nice vibrant orange like Jack and then we're going to dunk our balloons into our little bowl. Oh. Take a photo of that. Okay now depending on what kind of food colouring you're using, you may need to add some more oil if it starts to thicken too fast. This is about the consistency you want, so that it's still liquidy but it's starting to hold its shape. So what you want to do is grab a tiny bit of the chocolate mixture. And this is going to be the base of your bowl. Just put it on some baking paper and let that sit for a second. So we're just going to dunk our balloons into the chocolate. And what you want to do is just swivel it around so it's all evenly coated. Just gonna let that dry. <laughs> so, cute. so cute. Then repeat with the remaining balloons. I like this size, so we're actually just gonna use the pink ones. Might blow up a few more. So cute. Baby. 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 Okay. Once your chocolate supply dwindles, just get a little spoon and you can also just spread it like Nutella. So I'm just letting mine sit aside over that side and then just until they harden. You can speed this process up by putting them in the fridge as well. But while that's happening, I'm going to eat the rest of this. How you doing, Jack? It's been about five or seven minutes. They're starting to harden quite well. I'll show you in a second. We're going to melt our dark chocolate chips with a little bit of oil in the microwave, again at 30 second bursts, until it's all nice and melted. Mm. Don't worry if there are a little bit of lumps when you take it out of the microwave. The residual heat in the chocolate will melt it all. So now that our bowls are set, they're nice and hard to the touch, what we're going to do is take a pair of scissors or a sharp object and nip the top of the balloon so that all the air can come out and the balloon will come apart from the sides.
Mini Jack. Jack Jr. and Big Jack. Jack Jr. No. They're so cute. What do you think, Jack? I like them. <laughs> I like them a lot. I like them a lot. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. I think you have chocolate on your elbow. How? Do you want to go wash that off real quick? Not like that. <laughs> okay, guys, we've decorated them. And they look so cute. I'm so excited. Um, what we're going to do now is scoop some ice cream in, top it off with some Halloween colored M&Ms, and then we're going to eat them. I'm so excited. They're so cute. jack-o'-lantern dessert balls. I love them so much. They came out so much cuter than I expected and I really want to eat them. I hope Jack is impressed. Let's eat. Okay. Okay, so we just eat them. I kind of want to pick it up and bite it though. Because otherwise you don't That's get any idea. Okay, Can I have the cute one? You can have the cute one. Buns. The cinnamon pumpkin. pumpkin. They're, both, they're both cute. The cinnamon pumpkin. The cinnamon pumpkin. Okay, um, I'm just going to go. I'm just going to bite it. Okay. I'll go with real Jack here. Oh my god. Oh, mm. chocolate. I think we'll ice cream on this. Me too. <laughs> but yeah, it's really cute because you can put ice cream in this. This will also help mm. the chocolate um, the chocolate bowl stay nice and firm. But you could even just put chocolates in it. Let's be honest, we're probably just going to have ice cream in it because mm. <laughs> who doesn't want to eat that ice cream bowl? It's like, mm. oh. Mm. Oh, so oh. Yummy. I might just eat one of these myself later on. <laughs> but yeah, it's a really fun idea and I really hope you try it because it's so adorable. I mean, just look at him. Jack would be proud. Mm. Nom, 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 nom. Oh. Yum. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. And if you want us to make any other food or recipes from anime, manga, TV shows, movies, games, let us know. Comment in the section below. Message us on social media. Talk to our faces. We're pretty friendly, so if you want to. Um, but yeah, so see you next time. Bye! Bye.